Hello friends. In this video, we'll be understanding the strategy templates that we have shared with you on your email, how you can add that into your TradingView account, how you can backtest it, and how you can verify the trades on the charts. So in order to do that, firstly, you'll have to log into your TradingView account. And I believe that the Speedbot team might have shared you the links regarding the trading strategy templates that we have. So I believe that if you have these set of strategy templates shared with you, so it is pretty similar to the other templates. So the process in general is pretty simple. So as you click on any one of the strategy templates, so this is the window that you'll be able to see. So over here, you'll be able to see the historical testing that Speedbot has done. You'll be able to understand the literature behind the strategy template, how the strategy is working. You'll be able to understand more on this. So over here, if you click on add to favorites, so this particular indicator or strategy template would be there in your favorite section on your Speedbot account. Let me show it to you. So right now I have opened up the trading view chart. So this is for NASDAQ mini futures. So if I search for Speedbot, let me just refresh it from my side once. And now let me just type in Speedbot and over here I'll be able to see the Fibonacci strategy. This consists of the buy sell signals for NASDAQ mini futures. I'll be able to see the list of trades over here like this. So this is a strategy template that you can use irrespective of the number of symbols you trade on. Let's say that if you are trading maybe XAUUSD gold or maybe you are trading in Euro USD or USD JPY. So you'll be able to add that from here itself. For example, for Euro USD, like this. Just a minute. Let me just check another symbol. For example, this, this seems pretty illiquid. Yep over here I can see the strategy tester how good or how bad my strategy is so all in all I wanted to make you understand that you can have as many symbols as you want in order to test it what works best for you so we'll be checking out other templates as well quickly for example this is a momentum based strategy template that I can use. So let me add it to my favorite section. If I go over here and I type Speedbot, let me refresh it. And I type in Speedbot. So I'm able to see the momentum band. If I add it like this, I'll be able to see, okay, Let me add Euro USD like this. I can tweak the parameters around in order to check how good or how bad my strategy is performing. So likewise, I can do it for the last. I can set the input, the parameters like this stop loss value and play around. So over here, I can play around with the sources, the stop loss and the take profit levels in percentage terms. And again, I can test it. Let me delete it and show you the last bot. So this is a bot that we have. Let me add this. Now, if I hit the refresh, And again, I click type Speedbot. So this is the RSI based strategy template that I have. 
So if I were to have some deep back testing, I'll be able to perform that. Maybe on Euro USD, it will work. So over here, I'm able to see the here the bot took the long entry and here it exited. Currently, it has taken a long entry and still it is active like this. You can check the performance summary. You can tweak the parameters again, like I mentioned. So that's how you can test out the speed bot ready to use trading view strategy templates. If you have any concerns, then you can let us know. You can let our team know. They'll be happy to answer your queries. So thank you for watching this video.